now we will be creating a sheet for the hvc pumps detail uh, before that i'll cut some sections for the pump detail and uh, in that sheet i'll be showing one plan view two sections and one 3d view in that sheet like we have done for chiller also okay so for uh, the detail view for this hvc pumps i'll use call out okay so uh, call out you will find in the view tab and here is a call out so you can draw it by a rectangular or a sketch okay sketch means if it is not in the rectangular shape then you can manually you can draw okay but in this case i'll use the rectangle one okay select the rectangle and now in this case you cannot add it the lines okay you cannot add it the lines in that case for example i don't want to show these pipes okay now i want to show only like this in this uh, uh, one break line should be there this line breaks here and come down and like this so in that case you can use the sketch tool okay control z again i'll draw with the help of sketch tool call out sketch okay firstly i'll be drawing one sketch here okay now here what i want this line to be coming here okay again select one line and this line up to say here and this up to here and we can use a trim tool type tr <clears throat> select this line and select this line okay so this is how we can use the sketch uh, type of this callout so callout is basically a detail for a plan view in a plan plan view okay nothing so this is our callout and once it is created you will find one view here ground floor plan call out okay so i will rename this as hvc uh, pump or you can type as pump details pump detail uh, dash 01 okay so this is one detail we have created okay so uh, you can right click on this and go to the view or you can double click on this okay so in this uh, that view uh, that view template is not there okay so similarly you can create that view template like we have done for the sections also okay uh, but in this case if you want to add this uh, go to this view template okay and make it first none okay and first hide all the uh, linked cat file type pg go to the imported categories and check click okay okay make it fine i will hide this section okay and i also don't want to show this floor okay that it's annoying type f and flows okay which is okay now you can add some details here type tg <clears throat> okay <clears throat> Similarly for this also. Just make it here and move it to the side. Okay, and now you can tag the pumps. These. Double click taking the accessories also problem okay 
this is secondary pump okay and here you can uh, give a note for this bypass line for that i'll use the text and here i'll write bypass line close and add one arrow select this one and add one arrow indicating this pipe okay so this we have done the call out details after this i'll create one section from the side from this side okay click on this section okay and i'll draw in between these two so that both will come okay and just move it because we want to show one elevation and in that we want we have to show the uh, details of the valves okay so here just move it up to here uh, right click go to the view okay so in this section what you see here already it has taken the mechanical section template okay so if you want to if you want to change something you can go to this section view uh, template and make the changes now in this thing firstly what i want to change that if you know if you have noticed in the 3d view i have given the color for the valves as yellow okay yellow color i have given to them so in that section view also what i will do go to the section view i want to apply a yellow color line to these valves all the valves and accessories only okay this is in red color this is in white color so all that i want to be uniform in the yellow color okay so for that i'll go to the view template i'll go to the visibility graphic filters in that i will add one filter which we have already created valves okay click okay and now i want to only add the line okay not the fill the fill the color click on this line and i'll add yellow color and this to be solid click okay click okay then click okay okay so all the valves turned into yellow color which is okay now you can similarly you can like we have done in the ch chiller you can uh, annotate them okay type tg select this again type tg okay for the valves this is balancing valve and this one we can give annotation to this side pressure gauge okay and this is your bell valve isolating valve for the purpose for drain purpose okay and here both the side we have pressure gauge and we are left with the butterfly valve and the strainer so this i am giving the annotation to this side again type tg click and again click and this i am giving to this side similarly for this pipe also okay now remaining is the pumps this is uh, secondary pump and this is your primary pump okay this this pipe is coming for the bypass line okay so uh, you can manually give a text here for the bypass line I'll select this okay bypass line okay 
so this is how you have to do the annotation and one view i'll create go to the floor plan ground floor plan uh, from the front side okay this side so this one which we have created this is pump detail one this section two i will rename as pump detail two okay and next one i'm going to create from the front side okay so i will draw one section here from this side up to here okay clip this section and i want to show say up to here okay right click go to the view you don't have to do any settings already it is there in the view template only you have to do the annotation which we have already done but if you want to do you can no problem okay this is uh you can give here which is which the walls which are visible you can annotate them non and valve okay okay that's fine and just i'll crop this this is pump detail three okay now i will create one sheet go to the sheet right click new sheet here select this sheet architect d nsid and here uh, i'll be adding the details firstly i'll add that call out Allowed, I'll place say for example here. Okay. And you can change the scale 1 is to 50. Details, all the details should be in 1 is to 50 scale. And from detail here, from detail to I'll place here only the remaining is the 3d view in these thing what you can do if you want to hide these lines these are the crop view lines okay so you can hide that select this view and here we have an option for crop region visible uncheck this crop region visible okay now this will not be visible select this one and check okay similarly select this one and uncheck this okay and just and adjust these small things okay to make it perfect put here make it to here and put it in the middle similarly for this one to here put it in the middle okay only one view is left for the that is for 3d view okay so for 3d view uh i'll go to the chiller 3d view which we have already created in this what we have to do right click duplicate first rename this uh, delete pump 3d view okay and here uncheck this section box okay and you cannot rotate this because it is locked unlock this all right click zoom to fit and here select this any of the element and go to the top view okay and here we have these pumps okay control z select this one and select this one hold control key click 
okay these two are selected and when you select this section box so this rectangle will be selected all in the 3d view okay so select these two pumps with the help of tab and control key and click on the selection box okay ready okay now i want to crop this because these pipes are not clearly visible these are in the cut cut plane type vg and type s section box check this click okay so this to crop this this section box will be visible now i'll pull this up okay i want this up to here bottom okay back side up to here okay and this i don't want so i'll go to the right hand side view okay and in this i will hide this i don't want this even this also i don't want only up to this pump i want okay so this pipe if it is visible you can manually hide this pipe right click hide in view elements this valve also hide in view elements now once the view is set okay just adjust this orientation okay and this orientation uh, is with the help of shift and scroll okay press shift press scroll now rotate okay so in this i want this to be uh, say like this okay in this orientation now then i'll save the orientation and lock now i cannot rotate this okay type vg uh type vg annotation type s i will uncheck this because this will not look good in the on the sheet so uncheck the section box okay now this view i want in the sheet okay so go to the sheet and you can drag this to here okay select this one if you want to increase it more you can increase by decreasing the scale one is 25 this will be bigger okay just move these two down and this also down and this i will put it up to here okay and move it to this side okay if you want a bigger 3d view in that case you can uh, decrease our scale okay or 1 is to 50 is okay because all this we have maintained 1 is to 50 okay okay thank you